Hey guys, Fubbly here today and welcome back to Prison Architect. This is part two and you may have noticed I've made some changes. It's more or less the same, but I will walk you through. Obviously, I've planned out a few others as well. So we're only going to be looking at the one, the one cell block, because that sort of encompasses it all. Uh, so a few changes that I made. I have moved the classroom uh, to the top right. So that is now the classroom up there. And that can house, uh, what is that, eight, uh, 12 uh, prisoners if they want to learn. Uh, I've got showers, enough for everybody in here. I've made the shower room larger. Uh, that is uh, 24 showers, I believe, because we have 24 cells now. I added on four more cells just so that we would end up using all the tables and benches in the canteen. So now we have 24 prisons in each little block. Uh, enough showers for all of them, and we have about half the number of uh, desks, which is good. Four little solitary cells up the top here. Uh, this was going to be something. I, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what that was. That was just blank space that was left over. Uh, so if you have any suggestions, let me know. Uh, that is the common room in there. Uh, that's still the canteen, obviously. Uh, that is the cleaning cupboard. Uh, maybe that could be a second cleaning cupboard. I don't know. I don't know how many jobs that makes. We could probably have a second one. Uh, that is still the laundry just there. Obviously, all the cells. Yard out the back. And then we have visitation uh, at the end here, which joins onto the main hallway. So, uh, now for the rest of the prison, where everything else will be. Uh, just over here. So, ignore the existing buildings. I'm actually going to remove those because they're in the wrong spot. Uh, so, on the right here, we have the sort of utilities area. Uh, two power stations and little water. Uh, pump will go there. Storage room will just be there. So that's a sort of storage and utilities building. Down this way we have the five offices and that will be the staff room just in there. Uh, this is going to be our first kitchen uh, just here. This kitchen will obviously serve this uh, cell block at the top and the one at the bottom uh, just here. These are obviously all the same. The cell blocks are just mirror images. Um, and then down here is the infirmary and the morgue. I thought I'd just do it opposite the kitchen so it's sort of yeah, a little bit symmetrical there. Uh, moving down this main hallway is the security room, just as before. Although I made it a little bit more, a little bit more fancy. Uh, just here in this little section. This is outside. Okay. By the way, this might be kind of hard to tell now, but obviously this four wide corridor here is going to be sort of paved. Uh, these blank spaces in between are just going to be grass. So this is going to be like a fence or maybe a perimeter wall, depending on how much money we have. Uh, so these will be on grass in here. This is a kennel, and that's going to be kennel. So basically, we have room for four small kennels around this main central area if need be. Up the very back here behind all these doors is going to be the armory. And then obviously just another cell block there. And I think that's pretty much everything that is going to be in the prison. I don't think I've missed anything. I went through and checked it. I spent like an hour on this just sort of refining the design. Uh, it was just really boring to watch, so I didn't bother recording it because, oh god, that was annoying to do. Uh, so obviously there's no workshop in this prison because I do not plan on doing that. We might do it, but I, I don't know. Not now. There's no plan for it now. Uh, there's also no forestry or something else or execution obviously we never do execution because that room does absolutely nothing i still don't know why that is still in the game it does absolutely nothing at all uh at least make it do something or just get rid of it because it's the most useless thing uh and then yeah i think everything else is in here so what we're gonna do is um undo everything we did last episode so just gonna go uh foundations bulldoze just remove these two foundations because they are in the wrong spot Right, so I, I'm not sure how much money we're going to have in terms of... Because I don't know if I'm going to have enough money to build perimeter walls or not, but I guess we'll see. Did they remove the doors? Oh, they do remove the doors. That's awesome. That's handy. Okay, we're going to have a lot of garbage here. At least they work quickly with all these people. Right? That that just disappeared. So, first things first. Uh, we're going to build the concrete foundation for this first cell block. So, all of this bit here is indoors. Actually, not that bit. Uh, and we can demolish that. That little bit that's supposed to be outside. All right, then obviously this kitchen is indoors as well, so we might as well build that. Uh, this, uh, uh, what do you call it? Visitation is indoors, so we'll build that. Um, all right, we'll, we'll just work on these for now, and then we'll figure out where we're going to go from there. So let's go with doors. Uh, on the kitchen, we'll just do a staff door, because that's already in a secure area, so that'll be fine. Uh, as for the cell block, I'm not sure if I want to do... I guess I'll just do a large shell door, because there's going to be a ton of doors between there and the exit. Uh, Alright, we'll, we'll just use that door to sort of activate the area. Uh, as for the outside, should we, use, should we use solitary doors just because they're more secure? I would use a remote door, but due to the problems we had with not enough... We didn't have enough guards sort of manning the door control. And when the guards switch, sometimes they get stuck. So I'm thinking maybe if we do solitary door... Um, because it's the same price as a remote door, and it means that guards can open it. So I think doing solitary doors is just handy. 
Um, we'll do solitary on the visitation as well. Make it nice and safe. Because uh, I want to... I, the idea of this prison is to be like super secure, you know. All the prisoners are separate. Uh, they have their own separate blocks and everything. That's the idea. Uh, and we'll get... I guess we'll see how it goes. Uh, is is the uh, CEO's letter? Uh, go away. Thank you. Look at all that garbage. That's nice. Uh, not... Wow, oh, look at it. They have, do they have bigger garbage bins? I mean, garbage bins. But they have bigger garbage bags now. That's awesome. I mean, I'm, I assume it's the same sprite just scaled up or down, but that's interesting. <laughs> interesting. All right, so that should be that all built in just a second. Uh, any second now. That wants to build. The small... Oh, there it goes. And we're going to pause and cancel every single light there because probably all going to be wrong. Uh, the kitchen one should be fine, they're already in. The, I don't think it put any... Oh, there was one in there. Alright, so we'll replace the lights manually ourselves, because I don't want them to do that. Alright, so the other things we need to build, uh, let's just get all the buildings that we need done. So concrete, obviously we're going to need the storage building. Storage and utilities building. Uh, we're going to need the staff uh, building over here. Um, and we're going to need the infirmary building. Yeah, we'll build that. And that's probably all we need to build right now. Uh, what I want to do is go to bulldoze that bit there. Did I, did I get that? I don't know. Because I want to put the uh, the wall there and there. Alright, well let's see what they do. So we've got plenty of resources here. Now let's let them get underway, start building all this stuff. Uh, I guess we'll put some entrances on these so they actually construct. Uh, we've got double doors, so... Now, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, doors open to the left by default, so if we put one there, and one there. Uh, I'm, just, I'm obviously just seeing staff doors in these areas because they're not particularly, uh... I don't think I need to secure them that much, especially like the staff area. I mean, the, the armory and that, and probably the kennels and the, obviously the, the security room, I think we'll do so really secure doors on. But this other stuff, I think we should be okay. So, infirmary will just have a staff door on it. And so will the little morgue. Uh, let's get the concrete wall in there as well. Can't build one there though. Does not let me do it. Guess I have to wait till it's done. Ah, oh, yeah, the sun is setting on our beautiful day. Alright, so yeah, it looks like they demolished the foundation there, which is good. And then we will have... I guess we'll just do a... Should we do a jail do I don't... I'm not sure if I want to do jail... Uh, I, I guess we'll do double solitary doors. Just because it will be more secure. Like, I rotate them, but they seem to, like, the sprite on the, the, where the door handle is doesn't seem to rotate, but they still open the right way. I guess the only downside to doing double doors like this is that, uh, I'm gonna have to have two remote, uh, door things. Oh, and also I let them put on all the lights for everything else. I forgot to cancel that. Oops! Oh, well, that doesn't matter anyways. Okay. <laughs> all right, let's build the concrete. Oh, should we build? I don't know. I don't know if I want to do perimeter walls. How much are they? I mean, I do want to do perimeter walls for sure, but I don't know how much it's going to cost. Um, that's like 900. And then these areas in between, I guess we have to grass them first. Um, I don't know. Alright, well let's go... At least perimeter wall on the yard here. You know, keep them in. Keep them under control. Uh... I don't know about this other stuff though. I, I'll, on the front of the prison, I'll do perimeter wall as well, I think. I'll leave that a little bit there in case they get stuck, because they sometimes like to get stuck. So yeah, let's build uh, the sort of main walls. Leave those two little bits blank. Let them build all that. And then obviously this front wall as well should be a perimeter wall, I would say. I'll go there. And then maybe the interior walls could just be... Because I guess these interior walls don't really need to be perimeter walls. Uh, just the exterior ones probably do. So, I don't know. I'll, we'll look into that in a minute. Let's let them build all those. Uh, and sort of see where we end up. With that, I need to dismantle every single one of those lights in between there. Because they are in the wrong spot. They're on a wall and they're going to be dismantled anyway. So, let's get rid of those. Any other ones on walls? Yep, that one. That one. Those are fine. That one's on a wall. Uh, and the rest are fine. Okay. So, let's get materials. Concrete wall. I just want to do these two because I already uh, placed a door there. So, I'm just going to do that now. Alright. So, okay. Road gates. Let's also get some of those. Might as well get those now. 
So these open left by default, don't they? So that'd be fine. That'll go there. That'll go there. Down to 250,000, you know, we're getting quite low on money now, obviously. Uh, the front of the prison, I think we'll just use normal jail doors. Uh, I don't know, maybe I should just do regular jail doors on the, uh, on this main entrance. I don't know, but then, I don't know. I don't know what I want to do with that. I guess, I guess, uh, it's not that hard to change if you guys think I should change it next time. Uh, I, I wish I could see what was happening. Uh, it's so dark right now. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and, let's build the walls in here. So we can, uh, get the power and utilities in. Let's go to power station. Obviously we only need to do one power station for now. Just cause, no point doing more than one. Pump station go up there. Uh, and then let's go perimeter wall. Hope this guy doesn't box himself in, otherwise I will have to fire him. And if they trap themselves in when they build those, we will see. Let's see how they build them if they decide to trap themselves inside the, uh, these little circle bits. A little bit of little bit of electricity now, that's good. Uh, okay, none of them trapped themselves, which is good. Alright, build one there and build one there. Cool. Alright, let's go. Uh that's that's looking good in there. Let's let's get the uh extra staff doors onto there and onto there. So that's completed. Um alright, so yeah, we got the doors here. Let's go build this area. Uh, nice, nice, beautiful concrete walls. I do want to do, uh... What's the word I'm thinking of? I want to do windows. <laughs> I couldn't think of the word windows. Yeah, I, I would like to do windows in this uh, prism, because I never do them, so that'd be nice. Um... I guess I'll go there, and then where's that door? To there. Uh, this is just going to need a door. Go there. I'll be fine. All right, and then we're gonna go staff doors there, 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 and there, and then let's do a little double staff door there. That'd be beautiful. And let's get out our staff room and designate this area so I do not forget. So this area here is the main staff room. Then we're gonna have the offices wherever they are. I can't seem to find. Them. There it is. Gonna be obviously one there, one there, one there. One there, if I could make it the right size, and one over there. Cool. So that's that little building there. That's good stuff. Uh, yeah. So I'm not. I'm not sure if I want to. I like. Do I even need these sort of walls I've got placed around there? Uh, I mean, if I do, I think I need access to get in between. Like this whole area there is going to be closed off. So I don't know if I want to. Um, what I want to do with it. Well, let's get the let's get the pathway of the prison done because I know what I want the pathway to be. So it's going to be these concrete tiles. Get all the way up to there, and that will obviously go to the cell block as well. And then to any other door, like so. And then we're going to go... Uh, I mean, I guess a perimeter wall would be, wouldn't be a bad idea. Because then if they start tunneling, they're going to have to go through a perimeter wall as well. Which would definitely be something uh, of use. Uh, I guess we could do it. No reason not to. I, I I think I definitely need access to the perimeter wall. But the thing the thing is, as soon as you put a door in a perimeter wall, it just becomes that thing that if oh if they just tunnel through the door opening, like they could just go oop through the door and then go around that way because it'd be easier. So I don't know. I don't know if I want to do that or not. Well, that's that's gonna be grass anyway. So let's do grass there, grass there. They can have grass in their yard too. It's not it's not gonna be that harsh. They have nice grass in there. Um. And you have a little pathway like that though to the doors okay so that's the main pathway and this way as well to those two there you go it looks beautiful and then i'm going to go paving stones in these little uh gaps as well because i think that's what i did in the original prison where i had designed it like this if i'm not mistaken uh so let's go like that all the way down there there we go Cool. Uh, so let's, um, oh, I haven't done this bit. Let's do this bit. I guess we're building these walls and then just add access to them. I don't know. I still don't know. I'm still, I'm still very distraught about that. <laughs> very distraught about that decision. Okay. So these areas here, I might as well just make this all paving stone. I think this area for the garbage and deliveries and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, that'll work. Um, looking beautiful guys. All right. So let's get out to the, let's go jail door. Let's just have... 
access from. Hmm. Well, let's go. Let's go solitary door. Well, it doesn't need to be that secure. Let's just go door or jail door. There and there, and then we're gonna go perimeter wall like this, all the way around over here. There and there. Let's get this one in as well. Uh, and then we might as well just put this one in too. I uh, actually I didn't need to put paving stones in a lot of this place because the perimeter wall actually does place down paving stones, which I forgot about. Tilt your sand. I uh, probably want to put something in there, so I might leave that open, so they can access that. Probably put a little bit of grass in here or something, like that, like that. Make it look nice, you know. Make it look nice. It doesn't have to be horrible. Oh, yeah, paving stone there. I already did it. Okay. All right, let's uh, get them working. That's fast forward a little bit. We've got beautiful grass there uh, that they can uh, get to. They did not leave a. Uh... Is that? Hang on. What happened with that door? Is that that door is wide open, but uh, they built a wall there, which is interesting. Uh, that was not supposed to happen. So, okay. <laughs> Go materials, uh, demolish wall. Is it that one there? That I think that's where the door is. It's demolishing the door as well, but it's all right. We'll put it back properly because that was supposed to have a nice little door there. All right, and then I'm going to do probably a perimeter wall around the top, at least for now. That wall will probably disappear as we expand, uh, but I want it to be fairly secure, so we will definitely put that in. I mean, I guess we don't need we don't need walls there, do we? We can just leave that all as grass. There's no reason to block that off, so we might as well just go grass, grass, and then planning, get rid of that. Oh, isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? Yeah, that's fine, because then you come into the prison. Uh, let's get the these jail doors on, because none of these are on. Those go there. Uh, probably want to put one there too. One there. And we want to put this one back. I don't know. I, like, I don't know what happened with that. That just kind of disappeared and was never placed. Um, that looks good. That looks good. All right. So I need to. I need to build this area here too, just because of the fact that uh, we need. I need the the security room, and I also need access to that uh, visitation area. So let's go like that. Build these little areas on the side, like so, and then we need to go jail door there. And then we need to build the rest of this, which is going to be out of perimeter wall, I believe. So, yeah, it will be. So let's get all these. Let's get all the bits in that we need. Well, we might as well wall over that for now because we're not going to use any of those doors just now. So, so we'll go like this. Yeah, perimeter walls are expensive. I'll tell you. I'll tell you that. This goes there. That goes up to join that building. And then I think we will. I guess we might as well go all the way down there. Um, I'll just stop there. Uh, and then I want one probably five blocks away from this side as well, so they have to go a fair way before they can get out uh, as a security measure, but we will see. So let's just let them build this so I can get uh, a nice idea of how this all is going. Uh, so I want to, I guess from, if we go from here, wait, let, let me plan this out so I get in the right spot. Uh, four, five... It's going to be there. Put the wall. Basically, the wall's just going to go like this, I would say. Maybe all the way to that there. So it sort of just goes around that particular cell block for now. That will probably change in the future, though. So let's uh, let's see. So how much would that cost? Uh, I can't see because of measurements in the way. Oh, it's only 11,000. Yeah, go for it. Just build it now. Uh, we will... Yeah, we'll, we'll close this off. And then I, I will put a door probably... Maybe here from the front of the prison to access it, because that will be the most secure area to put the door. Uh, okay, you've put a door there and then... Wait, where did I put that one? There. So two in. <laughs> right there. That'll be good. And then we can go... Uh, right there. And right there. 
Cool, and then I'm going to grass that area, so it looks nice. Uh, I need to go into our rooms and put down the yard area, which is here. I did not mark it. I should probably have marked it. Ah, there you go. That's beautiful. How is that not enclosed, though? A minimum size 5x5. Five five. That is a problem. Uh, that is a problem, indeed. Can I just do that? I can. <laughs> did not think about that being a problem. That's, uh, that's only four wide, but if I just put it in the doorway there, beautiful. Can I do it? Can I do it like on this? Is it no? Okay, it has to go in a little doorway there. That counts. So we will do that. Actually, no, we will not do that because I don't want them being able to open that door in their yard time. So we'll just put it in those two doorways there. All right, that building is built. Nice one. And this is all going to be concrete tiles uh, in here. So let's just lay all of these down. No beautiful paving stones in this area. This is just all concrete. Oops. That goes the, oh, come on. It's there. Keep missing spots. Damn, this is one, one hell of a prison. Ah, right, that's gonna go all the way to the end. Uh, and then we want uh, paving stone on. Oh, hang on, concrete tiles there. Paving stone is in most of these areas, so just that little bit there, that should cover the whole area. Cool. Alright, let's fast forward. Come on guys, let's get building that perimeter wall. I know it takes you pretty much all day to get a wall built, but you know, it's one of those, one of those many struggles of life. It's definitely starting to take shape. My, my vision is becoming a reality. Uh, whether it works or not, no, we won't really know for a while. Uh, yeah, so once obviously we've got all these basic buildings done, then we can start actually doing all the rooms and everything. Uh, there appears to be a hole there. Is that any particular reason for that? Or I just left a hole? I think I just left a hole. That should not be a hole. That should definitely be a wall there. Uh, and someone needs to put in that door as well. Because I, I can guarantee at least one of these people is going to get stuck in this area. Let's see. Well, maybe not. They all seem to be pretty good. Let's see if anyone gets stuck. Oh! There we go. Yeah. <laughs> you idiot. There he goes. They put the door in. And they're coming to build this wall now. Nice. Uh, there's also a door there. Which I probably shouldn't have put in. And one there too, which again, I probably should not have put in. Just because we're not going to build this section yet. Uh, that's okay, I guess. <laughs> Alright, well, let's... Uh, Let's do a little bit of decorating here. Let's get decorating! Let's go a little bit of grass in the kennel area. The dogs like a little bit of grass. This is all going to be grass around here too. It's going to be nice, like... the You know, we want it to look nice and presentable, but it's actually a harsh, harsh place to be. And you don't want to ever be locked up in this prison. That's basically the way I want to run it. Uh, so let's actually remove... That door and that door. I'm going to put a perimeter wall in those two locations. Because those are... Probably should not have put a door there either, now that I think about it, because that's exactly the same problem. Uh, <laughs> dismantle that door there too. Don't want any weak points in this wall, and we have many of them. There's, okay, there is a door there, there's a door there. Door there. Uh, just need to put, make sure I have doors everywhere they're supposed to be. Uh, there's already one there, cool. There needs to be one there though. Uh, is there a door there, or is that just not... That needs to be a door. And that's a door. So that should be fine. Let them get that grass in. Do a little bit of a uh, landscaping. Nice. And then we'll definitely put lights down this little pathway as well, which would be quite nice. I think it would be absolutely beautiful once this is done. All the grasses are being laid. That's good. Okay, so I think they're done. Maybe a few, one or two more pieces there. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I need to, need to patch up this wall. Let's patch up the wall. Right there, and there's the other little spot over there. Let's patch that up. So we don't have any holes. Oh, and over there. So we don't have any holes in this sort of wall. <laughs> Weak points in the perimeter wall. Don't want those. You don't want them to have an easy way out. Alright, so it looks like we're doing pretty well now. Let's go into our utilities and let's start running the cable, uh, the the power. I have the power! So that's going to come down here and it's just going to run down the center. Get straight into the security office right there. There we go. 
And that's obviously going to go up into this place. Probably down that way. Maybe that way into the uh, little, into some of these rooms so we can light them up. Uh, that'll probably be fine. Uh, that's the kitchen, so we'll go in there. And then if we go straight down this way as well, that should hopefully light everything that needs to be lit up. Maybe not the bathroom though. I should probably put the lights back in here too, so we can actually see. Alright, well let's wait till they do this, then we'll start putting the lights back in, because I don't know, uh... I'm gonna light a cable in there. there we go. The kitchen should light up in a second, that'd be nice. That'd be absolutely beautiful. Oh, there you go. Uh, forgot that we did not have walls in there yet, so we should probably build some walls. Oh, well, might as well let them lay the cable first. Uh, okay, get the cable down to the security room. Uh, we can start marking some rooms, actually. It's probably be a good idea so that we know what is supposed to be where. Uh, where is... Oh, I've got to unlock it. All right, maybe we should get the office done so we can start unlocking stuff as well. Probably would have been a good idea to do that first, which is what I had originally planned to do first. Never got around to it, though. So let's go this way, bring the cable into here. Don't know how much that's gonna, if that's gonna get into the rooms or not, but we'll see. Uh, yeah, it does get every single light. Cool. Alright. It's easy enough. Okay, let's go into our rooms. No, not rooms. Objects. Uh, which way does this go? Can't tell. That way. So we have a little desk there. Oops. A uh, little desk there. A little desk there, there, and there. Uh, the psychologist will be in, in this, uh, one of these buildings. I, I, I don't have, uh, a prison, uh, accessible office for the, uh, for the psychologist. Um, but I don't know what I'm going to do about that. For now, I'm just going to let him be in one of these offices just because that's the way it is. And I, I didn't, I couldn't really think of a better way to do it. But that's something that's not hard to change later on anyway, so we'll... We'll face that if need be. Um, I'll put that there as well. Yeah, well, we'll face that problem if need be. So let's get all these offices in. And then we'll hire the warden. $210 a day, still making money, which is good. We're down to $150,000. This is expensive. This is so expensive to do this stuff. All right, little warden is in his office. Let's uh, go into a bureaucracy. Uh, let's just research everything we can from the warden. There you go. There you go, Warden. Have a bit of fun. Uh, okay, so let's start building some uh, walls for this cell block. And we'll add every, every other, everything else that we need walls for. So let's start building those. There will be metal detectors in this prison, by the way. I uh, don't think I mentioned that previously. But there definitely will be. Uh, so probably just behind a bunch of doors everywhere. We should, we should do a uh, metal detector for every prisoner's cell room. Or cell block. No, just cell. Not cell room. Why don't I even say that? There we go. Through there, down that. This is very tedious to uh, <laughs> to build. Oh, you may have also noticed that I stagger the doors on the cells. I don't know. Someone someone just suggested. Can you? Can you? They just said. Uh, can you stagger the doors on the cells? So I was like, okay, I will. I will do that. Did not mention that until just now. Why is my cursor doing the little loading animation? Okay, we're good. I don't know. That was uh, that was concerning. Uh, I would be devastated if I found out that I accidentally planned something wrong after all of this. Like, <laughs> like if one of these cells is too small, like one of these cells is too small, and I didn't notice until now, and you'd been saying it the whole time. That would be devastating. But we'll find that out when I when I get to the point where I'm like, oh no, Flabaliki, you made a problem. All right, let's let's wait till they build all that then, and then we'll start putting in the lights. Oh, I guess we can start putting the lights now. Uh, Alright, so lights, we want one in every cell, because, you know, we're that kind of prison. We're nice, we give them lights. Um, one in every cell. One there, one there, one there, one there, one there. Um, there you go, one in all these ones. Don't really need them in the hallway, I wouldn't suggest. Uh, one in the laundry, one in the cleaning cupboard. Probably... Let's go four in the shower, just to light it up quite nicely. One... We'll go one in every solitary cell, just because they're nice. One in that random room, I don't know what it's for. Uh, probably need some in the classroom. Would be good. Why is this in... We'll get, we'll get like... Uh, get a few of them, just so it's nice evenly spaced in there. Uh, canteen, we will go... There, 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 and there. 
And this is the rec room. So we go one at either end and one in the middle. That works. Cool. Looking good, guys. Looking good. Well done. Good hustle. Good hustle. Did not build all the walls, I just realized those. So let's uh, get those in. Alrighty. Looking funky. Alright, so all the doors, I think, in this <laughs> in this place should just be like solitary doors. So everything is just like, yeah, good luck, mate. Uh, or, or, or jail doors. Um, I'm going to do... I'm going to do solitary doors on every single cell. You know what? I'm going to do it. Uh, probably a waste of money, but... I mean, it most definitely is a waste of money, but, you know, we're doing it. So, yeah. Come at me, bro. Let's get all these doors in. Very expensive, too. But you know what? We got the money. We won't have the money at the end of this. That's for sure. <laughs> we definitely will not have the money at the end of this. Oh, did I? Oh, I don't know if I rotated that or not. There you go. That goes in there. Um, just everything. Solitary doors. Even solitary has solitary doors. Even that random room has a solitary door. Uh, even the classroom has a solitary door. Uh, even the canteen has solitary doors. Uh, even the rec room has solitary doors. Uh, the only thing that doesn't have solitary doors is going to be the shower, because I don't, I don't want to double up solitary doors again. So we'll just do jail doors. <laughs> the only thing that doesn't have solitary doors is the shower. Uh, Shank City. Shank City doesn't have solitary doors. Damn, this is, this is abysmal. Look how gray it is. This would be a horrible place to be. Uh, we will, uh, I think we'll class it up a little bit though. I think we'll class it up a little bit. Uh, but we'll come to that. We'll come to that. Let's, um, we got, a, well, we got a lot of lights in there. Did we ever put a light in there? I don't think so. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, let's, let's get a light and visitation. Because that'd probably be something we want to do. And utilities, electrical. Let's get that to go to there. Just for the sake of symmetry, let's get the, the wire to do that. Probably could have brought the wire around this way, actually. Maybe it would have made more sense, but... Uh, oh, well. All right, let's get the, let's get the pipe as well. So if we want to go... Uh, down this way. Uh, so this needs to go to every... Jeez, okay. Uh, if we go... Maybe if we go in the middle... Uh, the only problem with this is he won't be able to, they won't be able to lay the pipe. See, I should, I should have laid this pipe before I did it, because I want to go straight down the middle here, so I could get everything, but they won't be able to put it in those cross sections, because there's walls there. Should have laid this down before, uh, doing those walls. Um, yeah, let's just get rid of all those. Uh, let's let, let them get rid of that. Uh, hopefully they, uh, I'm just wondering, because this pipe, if this pipe goes straight down there, say they could just tunnel into the pipe, right? Uh, maybe that wouldn't be a good idea, because they could go in the pipe, go all the way down there, get out there. I wonder if we can, um, I think the, the length of these are, they go 15 blocks, or 15, yeah, squares. So if we go 15, it's not long enough. See, I want it to go all the way out of the cell block. Mm. And also these ones are off, the, off center, which is annoying. Maybe it is long enough. I don't think it is. And, oh, you can't go through uh, solid, oh, solitary. Uh, perimeter wall. I forgot that you could not do that. Uh, let's figure out this way. So what if we do this? Can we get water to go there? Uh, I need to probably power the thing as well. Would have been, uh, probably number one thing we should have done. Uh, yeah, we're gonna have to go straight through where that power station's gonna be. Just remind me to remove those cables when we put in a second power station. Because that will not end well. Uh, I just want to see if the water can actually flow that far. I don't know how far it can flow. Because having a small pipe in the building would be, uh, much better than, uh, having a large pipe running through the center of the cell block. I would, I would imagine, anyways. Not entirely certain, but... Can't, it can't be any worse, that's for sure. Uh, so it gets up to there. Okay, it does go all the way. Maybe it goes 30. Maybe it goes 30 blocks. I'm thinking of. I don't know. Alright, let's just get this to go... 
down to there, because that's where... I dismantle all of those pipes there. I was going to dismantle some of the electrics, which is annoying. There we go. All right, let's get rid of that pipe, because then we'll just run the yeah, run small pipes up there, I think. And especially if they do tunnel into this pipe, then they still have to go that way and then back around. So not exactly efficient. So it might, it might, it might work. It might work. We shall see. Uh, all right. So small pipe uh, is need, gonna need to actually it actually needed to do a little naggle there. So I might get rid of that bit. They all need to go that because that's where the toilets are going to be. Just going to do like a web of pipes was the uh, the plan anyways. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be, it's not going to be, yeah, it's going to be a little bit messy I would imagine. Having these sort of pipes all running through here. But it should work. There you go, water is a flowing. Uh, let's, uh, let's see if it gets all of it. Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> that's the only problem, I guess, with staggering the doors is now I have to have the pipes go a little bit, a little bit wonky, but it seems to work, so that's good. All right, for the showers, and then we're obviously going to need to go straight down there. And oh, that's handy. The laundry is just there as well, so we we cover the laundry as well. Uh, no, I don't want to do that all the way down. Let's just do that. And that will not go there because there's a perimeter wall in the way. Cool. All right, so that should get all that plumbing in. That we need. Uh, gonna need some plumbing in the kitchen. I think we were gonna have the sinks just here. Like where these three are, yeah. So if we just do that, that should be fine. That should get the sinks quite nicely, and then those are gonna be cookers. I, I imagine this kitchen is gonna be enough for uh, 48 prisoners, but I don't know. Probably not. We might have to do another kitchen or just make it larger, but we'll see. Uh, it should definitely be enough for this uh, 24 anyways. So, uh, running all the way around that way to get those pipes in. He's doing a good job researching, so good on you, mate. Good on you. Uh, I am pretty happy with how this is coming along right now. We got all the uh, utilities in, uh, which is was quite good. We don't have any door controls yet, though, but we'll do that later. Hmm. We could probably use a gardener to clean up all this mess everywhere. But that is something that we'll have to wait until another day. So there we go. Let's, uh, oh, before I completely forget and come back ne next episode and wonder why this happened, let's go ahead and put those walls back. Uh, and while I put those walls back, we will, uh, I will, I will start wrapping it up. Uh, also, we don't have power in some of these things. So let's get a little bit of power in here. Uh, I just want to get all the utility stuff done now. The I can't believe the cable does not reach up there. So close. Let's put it in the doorway though. That should help. Uh... Yeah. Alright, can you guys, can one of you guys put, okay, there you go, so the infirmary and the morgue are now lit up. Uh, is it, there's no light in the morgue, is there? Uh, no, there is not. Let's get to, get that in there so it's not, not it's too deathly, you know. Uh, okay, so now everything is lit up, we have utilities and plumbing everywhere it needs to be. And I think, yeah, we'll, we'll definitely call this episode a day. Again, comments, suggestions, and feedback down below. Um... And I will see you next time. Oh, wow. Eight, we get $8 an hour. That's pretty good. I will see you next time and have an awesome day.